should receive um, seven, seven days a week. Uh, we are delivering today um, around 1,000 meals. Okay. Wow, that's a lot of meals. We have a lot of um, Holocaust survivors that came on service, but also because of population is aging yeah, and need more help. And they don't tell you where the numbers are. So if you left, you don't know. You know what taxi the taxi is usually on the taxi. Take time off, or they go away to Florida, or they travel on vacations. Um, it does leave us in a hole in terms of having the drivers to get the meals out to those clients that that desperately need the service. Stewart says H O H, hard of hearing. Okay, so. Part of our program is the Jewish community, um, so having that support from a, from an organization like the UJA is is of great help. Hi. Hi. For you, Shabbat Shalom. Hello. Hi, everyone. How are you? Shabbat Shalom. Yes, yes. Come in. Nina, hi. I'm very happy with the healthy meal because I'm 92 years old, and when I have the meal, it's helped me to put to have it home. Very nice people, and uh, they talk to me and uh, smile. Very nice people. Hello, how are you? I feel like to, to see the faces and to be on the ground is, is very important for each of our staff to know, you know what we're all working towards. Puts a, a human face on all the all the good work that we do at UJA.